Are you looking to purchase a home but don't have any money saved up? We got a three year game plan for you. I'm gonna walk you through a scenario of someone looking to purchase a $500,000 home using the FHA loan, which is highly recommendable. The interest rates are low, down payment required is low, debt to income ratio is easy to stay within. So we're looking at about 3.5% down. That's $17,500. Closing cost is typically around 2%. We're gonna round it up just in case, so we're gonna say 2.5% for closing costs. So that's 12,500. Add it together, you're looking at about $30,000 out of pocket that you need to save in order to purchase this $500,000 home. So what I want you to do is to divide it by the amount of months, right? So we're looking at $30,000 divided by 36 months, that equals $833.33. Now, if you want to get to this number faster, you might want to explore investing. So let's just say you put that $833.33 over three years at an annual rate of return of 10%, which is since its inception, its inception in 1924, the S&P 500 has earned over 10% and in the last 10 years, over 11%. So that's $35,108.20. Now that number is very, very important. Why? What do we know about real estate? It typically appreciates year over year. So a $500,000 home in three years with 4% appreciation, it's gonna be worth about $562,432. Now we're looking at about 6% to save, right? Cause it's 3.5% down, 2.5% for the closing cost. So 6% of that, is $33,746. Now, the $30,000 that you would save, you put in it into your savings account, is not gonna be enough. However, if it is invested and you get the 10% annual return, you're looking at $35,108.20. That's more than enough. So you might want to explore that option to help you get to the savings required faster. My name is Anthony. If you have any questions, just let me know. And as always, take care and stay safe.